studio, so we did a couple of variations. The first one that we did was a uh, normal two hands and blood tuck. So we went one, two, lift it up, three and four, five and six. Remember, leaders, I said this requires a two hand hold. Some of you were doing this, which is a sugar tuck. It's a tuck turn, but not the one that I wanted. So two hand hold, leaders step out of the slot like left side pass, one, two, lift the hand, three and four, come over, five and six. Then, the second one that we did was a push away tuck. We have a two hand hold. I redirect the lady's momentum away from me as I go away from her, and we kind of get leverage position before she goes around on four. So we go one, two, three and four, five and six. Again, one, two, three and four, five and six. Then from there, leaders, I said, rather than you coming into the slot and squaring up, you're going to do a side rock cross. Followers are going to do a hip settle before they come into for the one. So I went one, two, three, and four, five, and six. Left side pass. One, two, three, and four, five, and six. Go full. So I'll do it again. So we went one, two, three, and four, five, and six. One, two, three, and four, five, and six. Then, leaders, I told you, two hand hold over the head by the top into a basket whip. So I leave the lady as if I'm doing tuck turn the same way, but instead now I bring both hands up over her head at the same time to let her know we're talking, and then I rotate her turn. So I go one, two, I lift the hands, three, and bring above four, five, and six. Now I have my right hand underneath, my left hand above. I pull the right hand as if we're doing bow and arrow, and then I bring the left hand up over her shoulder to do the basket whip. I come around five, six, and I go with the right hand, seven and eight. So again, we went one, two, three, and four, five and six, or one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven and eight. And that's all we did. Good, good, good. Thank you. Good job.